this video, I'm going to show you how to make a DIY beanbag toss lawn game. It'll get you outside in the sunshine and it's fun for the whole family. I made it from this one coal multi-purpose pine panel. And just like that, you can make one yourself. I cut the pine panel in two, added some legs at the back, and now we have a lawn game. So as I said, I cut it in half, making each section 900 millimeters. Then I find the center of the board and go in 15 centimeters from the edge. Make a mark, and here's a cool trick to draw perfect circles. I'm using a nail, go down to the radius of my circle, which is 8.5, because I want a 15 centimeter circle, hook the one side of the tape measure and then you push the tape measure on the other side just like how I'm showing you and look at that it creates a perfectly drawn circle that I can cut out later with my jigsaw what a cool nifty trick I'm glad I could share that with you and it's definitely a cool DIY hack to try so now we have to cut out the circles I first use a 10 millimeter wood drill bit and that's so I can get the blade of the jigsaw in there. And now you just have to maneuver the jigsaw carefully on the line and cut. If you make mistakes, you can always tidy them up by sanding or just cut the circle a tiny bit bigger. But this one, I tried not to rush it. And as you can see, I'm on that line and that one looks really, really good. And I spaced each circle out 15 centimeters from each other. As you can see, I cut out six circles, three on each half a pine panel. And then I just give everything a light sanding and then use a sander's block or a piece of wood and some sandpaper and just sand the inside of the circles by hand because those are hard to reach places. Now I'm decorating the boards using a medium wood stain and then I just cut these four legs to size they are 300 millimeters in length and those I'm going to attach later. So as I said, using some masking tape and just doing some cool designs on this board. Anything you can do, really any color you wish, it's your fun game to decorate. And as I mentioned to you, I cut four legs to size and attaching two using hinges. That way it's easy to store in the garage when you are not using the game and playing it in the garden. My version of this game is also light to transport, easy to place in the garden and easy to store away. And it's a fun DIY and a fun DIY to have a game or two with. So if you like this DIY, give it a try for the school holidays, a weekend in the garden, having a braai, or any time really, it's for the whole family. We hope you enjoyed this DIY because I definitely did.